you got? Does it make your list? Which one of these is your favorite? Dead or alive, take your pick. It's your choice, just don't boot me. Tell us what you want in your top five, and we gotta know the reason. Let's take a deep dive. If you're the same as mine, I'll be your number one supporter. Now relax and enjoy the podcast. It's no order. All right, everybody, welcome to the No Order Podcast. This podcast is brought to you by Sourdough and the True Hogs Club. We will go over the top five dead or alive rankings in no particular order, or you know your order. Covering any topic from foods to fighters and munchies to music, the No Order Podcast is the place for you to learn about our favorite things and to think about where you'd rank your own. So tune into the No Order Podcast wherever you stream your favorites, and please feel free to drop us a line at noorderpodcast at gmail.com. That's K-N-O-W-O-R-D-E-R-P-O-D-C-A-S-T at gmail.com. Today with our first guest, we have our homie Lucky on the line. He's going to give us the top five burger joints of all time. We want to thank you for joining us today on the No Order Podcast, but hit us with those top five burgers that you got on your list in no order. Oh, your biggest friend in the world. That means a lot to me, brother. If we're going top five, come on, man. I got to keep everybody happy with number one off the top West Coast, baby, in and out burger. Come on, Coming in hot. You turn a double double into a three by three, four by four, maybe a five by five, depending on what kind of night it is. You know what I mean? But in and out, easy, off cobs, easy. easy, animal style, mustard fried, all that, baby. Come on, you know what time it is. All right, my G, I got to stop you right there. Do you or do you not put the chopped chilies on the burger? Oh man, me myself personally, you're talking about the little pepperoncinis. Yes, sir. I get those in a little cup on the side. Oh, you already know. I take know. a nice big you bite of my know. burger, and then I take a nice little chunk out. You know what I mean? I take a nice <laughs> little hot, hot, you know what I mean, on the side. But, I mean, if you're feeling that, uh, some of very spicy, you can chop those up and put them on the burger. I particularly like them on the side, though. Oh, man. Me, myself. Man. Okay, okay. I respect that. I respect that. Okay, you got four more to run down. You already went with the number one right off top, in and out burger. What else you got next? Man, you know, number two, if you're in the Fremont, California area, we got to go with the counter, baby. Come on. The counter on Maui Ave, man. The counter. counter. You make your own Not burger. If, if any of y'all haven't been there, you make your own burger. Luck's going to give you the rundown for it right there. You make your own burger. Kind of like a five grand. It's a little fancy. You grab yourself a nice beer to go along with it. I just like it. You know what I mean? Fremont, California, no one's ever heard of it. So, uh, you know, you take a girl over there sometimes, and then she feels all fancy, especially if she ain't from Fremont. You know what I mean? But, <laughs> hey, I think uh, Fremont's uh, worldwide now. They were ranked the happiest city on earth, uh, I think, right before COVID. So, I don't know how it went down after that, but <laughs> well, yeah, because they got it, they got it, they got it in and out and a counter up in there. You know what I'm <laughs> That's saying? true. Like, That's who, true. Who be happy? That is Number true. Three, you, you know, you got to go with Five Guys, baby. Come on, man. Five you Guys burgers, burgers and fries. Five Guys. So you went two from the East Coast, and the third on the list is, I mean, West Coast, and two uh, number three on the list is going to be East Coast spot. Five Guys, Burger and Fries. Is Five Guys East Coast? Is that what that is? I think so. I think uh, Pennsylvania or New York. Uh, don't quote me on it. I got to look that up right now. But we can do that with the power of live podcasting. No, nah, yeah. I don't, I don't know. But Five Guys, you walk in there, right? Okay, check it out. They're fries. Let me talk about the fries. You like in Cajun style, the seasoned fries? Come that on, says a lot. Cajun. That says a lot. And while you wait for your fries and your burger, what are you going to do? You're going to chop up some peanuts. They got free peanuts right oh, there yes, for you, baby. Yes. So you, you know what I'm talking about. I know what you're talking get about. started on their milkshakes. Don't fill up on it. Ooh, goodness. milkshakes. Handcrafted real ice cream milkshakes, baby. Come okay. on. A little whipped cream on top or nah? You keep it too, nah, too I, I, I don't do the whipped cream. I try to watch my fingers. I feel, I feel, I feel, you you, you, know you got to like do it in moderation, you know? Arlington, yeah, Virginia yeah, yeah. is where Five Guys is from, I guess. Merritt Island, Florida, and then founded in Arlington, Virginia. Don't quote me. You better quote Google up on the uh, Wikipedia there. Well, I may be fat, but I'm not fat enough to know exactly where Five Guys came from. But <laughs> thank you, Virginia. You know what I'm saying? Yes, yes. It's okay. You don't You don't got to be that fat. We know you're a, a husky section shopper over there. There you go, baby. That's what my grandma used to call me back in the day. Okay, okay. All right, man. So where are we at? Number four? Number four here. We have the two uh, right now with the original breakdown of In-N-Out Burger, The Counter, 
And then five guys, burgers and fries. Number four, who you got? Number four is going to be another little hidden classic. I know I don't know if many people know about this one, but this is a Milpita spot. It may be everywhere, but we're talking about Wayback Burger. Have you ever heard of Wayback Way Burger? Wayback Burger. Brother? I have been Way to Way Way Back Burger one time in my life. It was absolutely fire. Tell tell the people about Wayback Burger. Let me tell you a little something, something about this Wayback a burger, okay? Wayback Burger is not your typical typical burger, okay? Yeah, I mean, you know, you get the buns and the lettuce and the cheese and the whatever. You know mm-hmm, what I mean? Mm-hmm. I'm with you. This I'm burger, with you. this burger comes on Texas toast, baby. Ooh. Texas toast. Okay. You like Texas toast without the burger? You like Texas toast as Texas toast is, right? Right, right. But it's now, something about that burger on there. Puts it over the top. They got this one burger, right? They got this one here, right? <laughs> a grilled cheese as the buns. Come on. Can I get an A? What? A-man? So it's grilled cheese and another grilled cheese? So four buns? It's a grilled cheese, four toasts, and grilled cheese. Bro. I'm just letting you know, baby. Bro. That's one of those. Uh, that sounds like hidden gems. If you want to make the drive to Milpitas on a hungover Sunday, you're going to have to do that. And, and, and their drive through It's like McDonald's. Come on, man. Get these people some recognition, man. We're going to have to do that. We're going to have to do that. Hey, Sapphilis. So that's number four. Number four. What number you got? Four, Top man. five. Top five. What you got for me? I, this is this is going to sound pretty uh, basic bit to me, right? But uh, <laughs> I say that? Can hey, I, it's your list. It's your list, not mine. No. Should I take a guess? All right. <laughs> take a guess. What's it going to be? Is it from... Is it a Whopper? Is it a Whopper? <laughs> I know I fit that stereotype, baby, but I'm not. I'm not the Whopper stereotype, man. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, I, I, I set the bar a little low there. That was a little low. A yumbo yeah, yak. I, you got a yumbo yak on there? We don't fuck with Jack and the Crack, uh, man. No, that Jack is and the not crack? happening out this way. No. <laughs> not even two Boston tacos, bro. Not a yumbo yak, not the two <laughs> yakos. No, no, okay, no. Okay, okay. I don't know, man. When I'm hungover, sometimes I, I, I like I like my little go to. You know what I mean? Sonic. Go to. Uh, the, I'm, uh, oh man, I forgot all about oh, Sonic. Does that knock your top five? Does that knock it out I, of the space? I, I, I think that's not. Yeah, we're putting Sonic on the list right now. <laughs> okay. Hell yeah, get you some Sonic with okay. some chili cheese okay. tots and a corn dog on this. Oh, side. for sure. Yeah. For Extra sure. Large strawberry sprite. Yeah, okay. we're doing it, baby. I get the hey, ocean man. water myself, that root, whatever. There the you large go. ocean so water. You, hey, fire. You, you, re, you reminded me, so that that knocked it off. That's okay. not my five. But we can, we'll give you the honor, honorable mention. What did you have in that spot that got bumped hey, out? It, it was nothing compared to Sonic, so I don't even want to mention it no okay. more. <laughs> okay, we won't hold it to you. All right, my man, thanks so much for joining us on the No Order Podcast with your top five dead or alive. You heard it here first, top five burgers from the man himself, Lucky. We will send it off and we appreciate you coming on the show and we'll see you later on this weekend. All day long, Dr. Dez, holla at your boy. All right, peace. That has been the No Order Podcast. If you'd like to join the No Order Podcast, feel free to drop us a line at no order podcast at gmail.com. That's K N O W O R D E R podcast at gmail.com. I'll catch y'all on the next one.